Cancers, you have um, basically a new spiritual perspective on what you believe about yourself. So, you know, I know a lot of cancers and they go different ways. Some cancers overly believed in themselves and then they got burned and then they felt bad about it. Some cancers believe in themselves with this, but they don't believe themselves in relationships. So because they're bad in relationships, they let their belief in themselves at work get tarnished. So you've let belief corrupt belief I've seen with cancers. You need a new, and, and all that, what your karma says is like, your belief in yourself is actually based on your past lives mistakes. They're not based on this one. This one repeated it, but they're not based on this one. So you have this new belief in yourself. That's the new spiritual perspective. Uh, the full moon in Virgo says the way you think about yourself also needs an adjustment. So cancers are adjusting what they believe about themselves and what they think about themselves both. Thinking and believing is what has to happen. A new perspective in the way you believe and the way you think cancer, which is not emotional at all. If you think about it, isn't that funny? You're a master of emotion, but it's your thinking and your believing that's choking up the ride and holding things from happening. Okay. So you're going to boogie when it comes to self-trust and intimacy. Cancers can, it's now time to trust yourself. It's now time to walk on water. <laughs> it's now time to actually own it and play it out and see where it plays and give yourself the benefit of all doubts to enforce all of your trust in yourself and spend it on something else. And uh, Jupiter at 10 degrees says, you've already learned, I think, how to be a friend to yourself in the world. Jupiter at 10 and 11 says, you know now how to make sure you don't get eaten alive by the critics, that you don't get taken advantage of by the salespeople, that you don't get uh, taken for a fool by your group of friends. You now have a strong sense of your worth when it comes to the world. You know what you're not worth. That's for one thing, okay? And so it's now time to take that worth that you know you are and invest it and fully trust yourself so that you can take some real interesting risks and you can make some real interesting things happen. It's serious joy, joy, joy.